which I am. I'm from Bridgeport, Connecticut. Born in Jamaica, though. The song that I'm about to release is called Over Me. Love. Me realizing that for a long time I was searching for something that was ready in front of me. I recorded this song back in um, October. It's more pain. It's like, I realized that the struggles that we go through as artists, like even coming up in this industry, everybody chasing their dreams, everybody starts feeling the pain and those that connect with all of us are the ones who can make it translate in their art. So I feel like all the pain I just went through, I was able to throw it in that. And then like, it took it away. I think it's all the same thing now. It's not even separate no more. Everybody's an artist. Everybody's an entertainer. Everybody's stuck inside their prayers. Everybody still has this phone. We all have the same tools. So you're, I think it's all, so to me this is all balance. Cause with me, I always do everything myself anyways. Now, like that I have a team that's really formed, I can like delegate stuff and send things out. But I'm usually so good at just finishing something myself and doing it that I never really, never really looked at that. I think right now it's 50-50 because the daily activities that you like, the things you do daily towards putting out a song, like those weeks, those months, things really happen for you to do business at the same time while you're prepping a song. So it's like it goes hand in hand. It's not really separate. Number one is Keith Lawson. He's from New York, but he's out in LA right now. He's out. I heard his um his real project that he didn't release yet, and I think that he's gonna be like when he drops that he's gonna be one of the best in the world. Him, I'm Jay Hall. He from out of New York too. He got the the melodic sound, but his music got a lot of pain in it. So like I relate to. Um, K Dose, I heard his shit too. Crazy, like the shit he about to drop. He ready? Well, my boy Junior from from Toronto. He got the like the island sound, the fresh new island sound. Right now it's done. I think I asked myself that every day while I was holding it or while I was working on it, trying to perfect it because I felt like with this song I recorded it months ago, but I had to I had to go through so much more to finish it. So it was like I felt I feel like I put more and more more and more energy, more and more pain into it just to make it get stronger as you're mixing it. So right now, like, it's the most powerful record that I have because it's recent. That's recent energy that I'm putting on it. And I feel like every record after that, it just has to get bigger. Tell the world that you over me, looking for the I would say Fab because He's like he's always in pocket with records like this, as as a crossover. But anybody else is like, I would have to be in the studio with them, the vibe with them, to see to even see if their energy matches it. That's that's a better answer for you because that's the reality of it. I could say a dame and their energy probably won't be there, 
what we what we actually be. So whoever my energy lines up with to do it. I don't care if it's a new person, if they got the, the pain and power in their voice to go on it, then I'm with it. I'm really not looking at just the A list. I'm looking at uh, what sounds, who, who's making music that sounds and feels good. Popping all these days when we overseas. Greatness. Looking for the one when you know it's me. Got some plans we should oversee. Popping all these days when we overseas. Pocket full of cheese, you know it's never enough.